the video and everything. Like I said, I'm going back to these old style videos and everything that I used to do before. But instead, I edit them, watch them again, look over it again, and all that good stuff. I take pride in my videos now and everything like that. And um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and all that good stuff, man. I really do appreciate all the new subscribers on my channel. I hope you guys stay subscribed to my channel. I hope you guys hit that notification bell, all that good stuff. I really do appreciate that. Salute. Bam. Today's Friday, by the way, as I'm filming this video. So this is what I do on Fridays. I do work tomorrow um, at about 8 o'clock in the morning or so. So I'll be all right. I'll be cool and everything like that. Um, let me say this. This is a real topic, though. This is for all the individuals who came up from the bottom, who came up from the gutter, who was not born with a silver spoon. That's as I can say. Now, I can speak for myself. Growing up, I had the, the, the necessary things that I needed, like clothes on my back shoes on my feet food on the table a place to live and all that but i was not born with a silver spoon i was not one of these um how can i say it? one of these uh rich spoiled kids you know what i mean you know you know um i've always didn't get whatever i wanted or whatever i asked for it. um that's one of the reasons why i work the way that i work now and i work hard for my stuff i didn't have this growing up you know what i mean um one big inspiration you know why I work how the way I work is because of my family. One particular one of my family, my older cousin, by the way. <clears throat> he had everything to this damn day. I'm going to say it like this. Had everything from money, cars, clothes, hoes, you name it. He had it. He got his own first apartment. That's one of the reasons why I'm going out, I'm going after to get my own first apartment. It's just that this shit's hard as fuck. It's not easy. You know? That's one thing I can say about that. Looking for a house, apartment, or even a car, it's just hard as fuck. That's like... Uh, Shit's complicated, man, for real, for real, on, that, on everything, but, um, anyway, that's one of the reasons why I work the way I work and everything, because of how the way my family was, how the way I grew up and everything, you know. Before I started driving and truck driving and all that stuff, I used to work in a warehouse. The work, the same warehouse that I am got the truck contracted to is the warehouse I used to work at back in the day under an agency and everything. So, I started from the deep bottom up, man, like, I'm telling you, um, like my baby mom even said it. She remembers back when I was broke as fuck. I didn't have shit. I didn't have nothing. Like, I was making barely ends meet before my daughter was born and all that stuff. Like, I literally started from the bottom. Like, my baby mama was there for everything. My wife, baby mama, she was there for everything. You know what I mean? And so she remembers everything. So I like to realize and to be grateful of where I'm at. I'm thankful to have a, a commercial driver's license. I'm thankful to still be working. I'm thankful for all the things I have. I'm thankful for my family, especially, man. Uh, Cause I'm thankful, man. Like, I can't complain, you know? I've been through a lot of bullshit. I've been through the things that I've been through and everything, but I can't complain, cause I'm still here. I'm still doing better than these individuals out here who doubted me. I'm still making these haters mad as fuck every single time. <laughs> you know, shout out to all the haters. You know, I wouldn't be where, I, where I'm at without y'all. You know what I mean? Y'all saw his way. But, um, um, let me say it like this. You can't tell, how can I put this? You can't tell an individual who's came from that struggle what the fuck to do with their money once soon as they come up and they start, you know, doing good for themselves. Like, for example, with me, when I really got my commercial license and everything, back when I was 20, I was young as fuck. You ain't gonna be able to tell a 20 year old what the hell to do with their money. It's just hands down. You ain't, you ain't gonna be able to do it. Like, I went from basically making minimum wage to where I'm at now. Like, this shit's crazy. Like, like I said, this truck driving stuff is not that bad. It's just hard work. It's what you put your effort into. You will make you some money out here. And this is a real talk right now. You will make you some money. So, you know, um, when I really got my commercial license and everything from what I'm remembering, it's like, I started seeing all this money and everything. I just wanted it all. Like, I mean, my mom was there for everything. Like, we, we wanted it at all. Like, you know, I'm gonna be real with you. We wanted it all. Cars, everything. Like, at one point, I had like five cars to, compared to the one car I'm down to now because um, my Red Expedition got totaled in a car accident a couple weeks back and everything. You know, it's another story. Another I'm only down to one car right now because of certain situations and everything. You know, 
bunch of bullshit, but yeah, man, um, I had, yeah, man, I just wanted it all, like, it's crazy as fuck, though, you know what I mean, like, you can't tell no, you know, you, no youngster coming out of the hood, coming out of the ghetto, like, what the hell to do, you know, it's gonna be really complicated, it was like, you gotta let people learn, and that's one thing with me, I learned, I've learned from all my good mistakes, from all my mistakes, and all my good decisions, like, you know, I'm not perfect, you know what I mean? Just because you got a CDL and everything don't mean shit. It's like, it's de it depends on the individual. Like, like for me, I come from where I come from. You know what I mean? I grew up where I grew up at. You can't knock an individual for where they come from or where they grew up at. You know what I mean? I grew up in Spring Hill West Apartments. Over there where the West Side Rolling 80s be at and everything. In the Crip territory. No, I'm not a Crip or nothing like that. As y'all can see, who I kick it with, the car that I run with and everything. You know what I mean? based on how the way I carry myself, how the way I talk, and you know, I speak Spanish, and the lingo, and the stilo, and everything like that, you know, I'm not one, you know what I mean? No disrespect to anybody out there, or whatever the case may be, I'm just being myself, I'm just being who I am as an individual, and that's it. You can't tell, like I said, you can't tell these individuals who come from these uh, urban communities and everything, like what the fuck to do as soon as they blow the fuck up, and uh, start getting this real money out here, you can't really tell them. Cause it's like they basically going from having nothing to something bigger and better like me for an example you know what i'm saying but it took me this long to get it in straight in my head like you know what you need to watch what you're doing with your money you need to uh, think twice about what you buy out here or you know what i mean think about it you know what i'm saying like real talk though it took me a while i'm not perfect i fucked up i made my mistakes i've done the things that i've done you know what i mean but at the end of the day i don't live my life in the past like i learned from all my mistakes and my bad habits and my wrongdoing and everything and I just move on you know what I mean so like I said I just put this like I said I just, I just made this video and everything I, I just made this video and everything just to get it off my chest and everything you know what I mean to basically educate these educate the young camaradas out here like you know what hard work does pay off and um, that you gotta think twice about what you about your decisions out here and what you and what you do out here just be careful you know what I'm saying but uh, other than that um, feel free to comment down below Let me know what you guys think Don't forget to like, share, subscribe And all that good stuff And until then On the next video Like I said